Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to another West Ham career mode. Now, as some of you will know, or anyone on this video will know, Lanzini was injured in the last game. Fortunately, it is only for 9 days, so we'll not be missing for long. But anyway, our next game is against Liverpool away. Let's try and pick up the 3 points, or at least a point here. Let's go. There we go, first real chance of the game. Noble is through on goal and he makes it 1-0 in the 12th minute. Fantastic goal, near post as well. Mistake from then, Noble, down to Gabriel. Come on Gabriel, make some room for yourself, good job. Got inside, finesse it, and a deflection and we make it 2-0. Back to back goals, 16th minute, come on. So make a tackle, no, clear that, clear that. Oh, oh my god, good save, goalkeeper. Okay, Gabriel's through, and I think keeper's gonna get there. He's not. Down to Kovalenko, got inside, shoot, 3-0, come on, and it looks like we have the three points in the bag within the first 36 minutes, and I might need to put the difficulty up as well because this has been fairly easy, but we'll see in the next couple of games, possibly at the end of the season, I don't know yet. Gabriel, Kovalenko's through again, is it four? Oh my god it is, we are tearing them apart, and I have no idea how. 4-0, come on, let's try and make it 5. And there we have it, half time, and we have absolutely battered them. All our shots have been on target and they have resulted in goals. They have had better possession, hopefully we can turn that around in the second half, but let's get straight back into that. We are no balls through, back inside, pass, shoot, and there we go, 5-0. Kuyate, I believe that is. This game is certainly in the bag. All I have to do now is worry about keeping the clean sheet. Alright, so I made a couple of changes. I brought on Olivia Buscagli, Marcus Brown and Parfit Williams. Uh, hopefully one of those lot can grab a goal. If not, I'm not really too worried about it. I just really need to keep this clean sheet. Keeper, please. Oh my god. 5-1. We lose the clean sheet, but we've still won the game. That sucks. There you go. Mark Noble is through. He's a bit slow though, so we've got to pass that to Buscagli. You should just be able to walk straight. Ah, that touch though. Alright, so that chance was the last of the game, but... Ah well, we won 5-1, our biggest win of the season. Our unbeaten run continues. Alrighty, and here we are. Transfer deadline day. Let's see what's going on. What have we got down here? A couple of big transfers already. Yeah, we've got Gundogan, he's gone to Atletico Madrid for 33 million. Shaka has gone to Valencia for 23.5 million. And Muslera to Everton for 16.5 million. Alright, and here's our first proper transfer offer, and it is for Chick Kuyate, but I will be declining that. He's far too important for this team for me to even think about getting rid of him. And there we go, there's a couple more big transfers. We have Godin to Chelsea for 34 million, and Goethe to Arsenal. 40.5 million. It's a couple of big deals to the BPL right there. And next up, Newcastle United want Winston Reid. That is also a big no no. He is our best defender. He's not going anywhere. And by the end of the season, he could probably be going for close to close to 20 million, depending on how we do. So that's we're not we're not taking that. The biggest transfer of this uh, of this deadline day is Pogba. PSG to sit for 60.5 million. That is a lot of money. A lot of money. Uh, that's deadline day over. The only transfer we made was Marcus Brown. I have sent him on a two year loan. And hopefully he comes back to us a fairly decent play. I'm expecting to score up a couple of overalls during his time away from us. Okay, and our last match of this episode is at home to Newcastle United. Alright, there we go. It's a lovely rainy day down in London. Let's get this first half underway and hopefully, just hopefully, pick up another three points. There we go. Kuyate is offside. Damn it, and he hits the post anyway. Oh my god, come on. There we go. Gabriel, make it 1-0. Oh my god, what a save. Valencia, shoot. Keeper saves. 23rd minute and we finally get our real chances of the game and we cannot take them. There we go. Kovalenko's through. Pass it down, Kayate, score, oh my god what a save again. Kovalenko down to Gabriel, Gabriel have a crack, 
keeper saves once again. There we go, they've made the mess up. It's going to be hard to get past Mbemba, we cannot get past Mbemba, is so fast. Alright, half time and we have had our chances, we just we haven't been able to take them whatsoever. Hopefully we fare better in the second half. Alright, so I made a couple of changes, I bought on Lanzini, Byron and Reese Oxford because he has requested to play in this game. Come on Gabriel, have a, oh my god, free kick, surely, please. Yeah, so we go. Um, and, ooh, that is close. And a Valencia, cut inside, cross it, score. Oh my god, please. Yes, there we go. Lanzini is there for the tapping. 64th minute, and we finally get the breakthrough. Here we go again. Gabriel switches past that. Through to Lanzini. Fit near post. There, yes. 2 0. Lanzini is fantastic. Gabriel, pass it down. Valencia, yes. 3 0. Come on. We certainly have all three points in the bag and we once again continue our unbeaten run. Here we go, Gabriel. Put inside, finesse. 4-0 and we are smashing this. And there we go. 4-0, the final whistle is another three points in the bag and our unbeaten run stretches to six games in all competitions. Thank you guys for watching, leave a like if you did enjoy it, subscribe if you are new and uh, yeah, tell me if you guys want me to up the difficulty, we are currently on world class but as you can see from these past two games, we are currently smashing it so let me know, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, all that jazz and I'll see you guys later, goodbye.